Hey guys, Psychic Pictures here, and welcome back to Let's Review Anime. This is High School DxD Episode 3. Let the fan service commence. So, it starts with the girl and Issei. Issei helps her up. Turns out the girl is lost and needs help. Issei helps her out and discovers that she is a nun with healing powers. The girl's name is Azia, and Issei helped her find the church, while discovering something is up with him seeing Azia's cross and the church. We then cut to Rias telling Issei not to go near the church because it is enemy territory, and causes major problems for angels and devils. Akano then informs Rias that a stray devil is causing trouble nearby. All of Rias's devils go investigate, including Rias herself. Rias then starts explaining that devils are similar to chess pieces. Rias is the king, pawns are foot soldiers, rooks are tanks, knights are, well, knights, bishops are healers, and queens are all of the above, except for the king, of course. They find the stray devil, and this devil has a tit cannon that spits acid. Okay. Random. Kiba then speeds through and slices the stray devil's arms off. He is the knight. Konako, the rook, throws the stray devil into the wall and breaks all her teeth. Her attribute is strength. Akano, the queen, then steps up, and her ability is electricity. And to top it off, she's really into s &M. If you guys don't know what that is, it's she gets off to making people suffer. Pretty much. Rias then makes the stray devil explode. Issei then asks what piece he is. Rias calmly replies and says he is a pawn. Okay, this first half is good, and it tells what devils can do. It also says some weaknesses that devils have. Asia is also introduced, and just saying, this is not nearly the end of us seeing her. On to the next half. Issei is taking a job, and sees his client's door is unlocked, and he gets the same strange feeling as he did when he was looking at the church. He enters the house and discovers that his client is mutilated and blood is all over the floor. Someone then introduces himself as Free. He is a priest and an exorcist. The two fight with Freed having the upper hand and just as Freed is winning, Azia shows up. She was with Freed to exterminate devils but she refuses to let Freed kill Issei. In retaliation, Freed cuts open Azia's shirt, grabs her boobs, and messes with her vagina with his gun. There. Priests aren't supposed to do that, are they? Yeah. <clears throat> anyway, Issei stops Freed from doing this. Rias and everyone else show up, and Freed then starts kicking Azia for lowering the barrier around the house. The devils then make their escape, and that ends the episode. Overall, this was a good episode. It showed what devils are up against. Priests, fallen angels, exorcists, and even their own kind. It also explains the game of chess and how it relates to devils. Another great episode to a great anime. It also shows the attributes of all Rias' devils, except Issei, at least for the moment. We are also introduced to other recurring characters, Is uh, Azia and Free. Azia is kind-hearted and sweet, while Freed is a sadistic, crazy priest. Saying this now, stay tuned if you are still interested. The next episode the next episodes are even better than these. Next, we have Hyperdimension Neptunia, the animation, episode 3. This has been Psychic Pictures, and I'll see you guys next time.